Hello, happy Monday. How are you today? This is Anna with Anna Goodall Fitness and I hope you've had a great day and I'm here to bring you your 10 minute bonus workout. I know it's late, but I always come to you late. So um, I just got home from work and I am here to bring you your workout. A little bit about me in case you are just tuning in. I am a certified Insanity Live instructor and I actually teach class a couple times a week and I'm also a health and fitness coach and have been coaching people for a little over three years now and my um, I'm trying to get people up and moving and that is my goal and I've got a cat that is going crazy right now so uh, he's kind of weaving in and out and meowing so um, he's kind of pushing us around Anyways, um, I'm here to bring you your 10 minute workout. We're doing five moves, 30 seconds a piece. Um, for the five moves, the first one is going to be squat kicks. Second one is going to be pike up spider lunge. The third is gonna be scissor stance jacks. And then plank knee tap. And then last one is going to be burpee. So I'll give a little bit of instruction for the first round. And the second round, we're gonna try to do as quickly as we can. And if you um, watch this and then do the workout or do it with me, then you will get approximately about 10 minutes. And if you do it two times around, you'll get probably a good solid 20 minutes and you can get a fairly decent workout if you combine all of these and do not take a long break. So that's the key. So I hope you got up and moved today. If you haven't, you can use this for tonight or tomorrow and uh, we'll get started now, okay? Here we go, except we've got the key cat. You need to move a little bit. Okay, so the first one was going to be squat kicks. So basically, um, if you haven't tuned in before, I uh, really want you to watch your knee-toe alignment. So when you go down, pretend you're sitting down in a chair, and it's a really good idea to bring your, your arms out so you have balance. If you keep them close to you, you might topple over. So you're gonna go down, kick, down, and watch that knee toe alignment, okay? So we're gonna start with 30 and we're going to do this for 30 seconds straight, okay? Let's go. Remember, watch that alignment and try to sit as far back in the imaginary chair as possible. And if you kind of, not kind of, but if you actually hold in your core, you will be a little bit more stable. But when you, take that leg off the ground you have five seconds you might lose your balance a little and one more okay so now we're gonna do that pike up spider lunge which I'll do kind of at an angle so basically you're gonna go in plank then you're gonna go up into into pike position and then spider lunge up to pike other side spider lunge okay so again, we're gonna start in plank, go into pike up, and then spider lunge on each side, okay? So we're gonna put 30 seconds on the clock. If you don't want to jump before we start the clock, you can walk up. And then, so you can totally take the jump out if you want to. Okay, so we're gonna start now. Plank position, here we go. also watch your shoulder elbow wrist alignment so you're not putting undue pressure but you're also working your shoulders your core and your legs five seconds one more okay now we're gonna do those scissor stance jacks so basically, I believe we've done stance jacks before, which was going down and up. But this time, we're gonna go down, a little jump, down, a little jump. So again, we're still doing that squat movement. So watch your knee toe alignment. Sit back as much as you can, and then jump. This one's not my favorite, because it's the uh, scissor movement that kind of bugs me. But the ones that really bother us 
are the ones when we accomplish them and actually are able to do them end up being our favorite so we'll see how this one turns out okay ready here we go and watch your knee toe alignment contract that core so you don't lose your balance try to keep your head up above your chest and go down as far as you can go into that seated squat position. Five seconds. And straighten those legs. Okay. Now we're going to go into that plank um, speed tap. So again, we're going to go at an angle, plank position. And basically, we're going to alternate with our knees and come up. So plank. So we're kind of tapping as we're coming up. Okay, watch your head, neck, shoulders, tailbone. You want to make sure you have a nice straight line, okay? And you don't want to have your head down or your head up. You want to have it in a neutral position. So a couple other things to keep in mind. And if you can't do all the different things, just go on plank. And if you keep proper form, you can start building from there, okay? So here we go. We're going to start tapping. Try to go as fast as you can. Keep that head in neutral alignment. Your spine, kind of find a place on the floor and look at that. How are you doing? Just keep going. Hold in that core. And you'll get a good ab workout. Five Good. seconds. And we're almost done. One more. Okay. So now we're going to, for the last move, do a burpee. And I think well, pretty much everybody knows a burpee. Basically, it's down, plank, short little jump up. Okay? And if you don't want to jump, you can go down, kind of come up like that. Okay? So we're going to do 30 seconds. Are you ready? Let's do this. Let's kind of do it at an angle. Ready? How you doing? Just make sure you got a good plank position going on. And you don't have to jump when you come up if you don't want to. You can just do this. Or you can add your jump. Five seconds. Five seconds. And one more. Okay. How'd you do? That's a little bit of a workout. More jumping than the last one that I did. Okay, so we're going to repeat that circuit one more time. And I'm going to catch my breath here for a second. But then we're going to try not to stop as much as possible. So remember, we're going to start with those squat kicks. Okay. So you ready? Let's do this. Remember, watch that knee toe alignment, okay? <coughs> ready? Try to kick as high as you can. And if you can't, kick low. It's okay. But I don't want to kick the cat. <laughs> How you doing? Watching that alignment. Make sure you sit back in that chair. Keep your arms out for balance. Hold in your core so you don't topple. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Okay, now we're gonna do those pike up spider lunges. Okay, little to no rest, good plank position. Here we go. Try to get those legs up by your arms. Try to get a high pike. The slower you go, the harder it gets. How you doing? You should be feeling it Five seconds. in your core. Okay. Now we're going to do 
my soon to be favorite scissor stance checks. Okay, so no rest. Are you ready? Let's do this. Try to straighten those legs when you come up. You might need to look down so that you don't know, topple. And then when I look up, I kind of lose my balance a little. So I'm gonna look about three feet ahead of me. Five seconds. Okay. I wanna do those plank speed taps. I'm gonna do that at an angle. How are you doing? Are you tired? I'm a little winded. Okay. Here we go. As fast as we can. Okay, let's go. Remember, keep that head in neutral alignment. Engage that core. Get those knees up as close to your chest as you can. Remember to breathe. You can do it. It's a little tough, but Five seconds. it's good for you. You push yourself. Okay. If you keep pushing yourself past your max, that's where your growth will happen. Okay, and for our last one, we're gonna do burpees, okay? All right, here we go. I think I'll jump every other one. Tired yet? Certainly max out with this workout. Five seconds. One more. Okay. How you doing? It's still super hot here in California. We've been having one heck of a heat wave basically since Saturday morning. So it's a little crazy. So I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you tried a little bit of it. Some of it may look easy, but I guarantee you it's not. You know, I do this all the time and I'm a little winded right now. So I hope it was a good one. I hope you had a good day. And if you do this in the morning, that's awesome. It's a great way to start your day. If you have any questions, please feel free to go ahead and tweet me or head over to Facebook on my page, Anna Goodall Fitness, and go ahead and drop me a line and uh, check out the content there. So I hope you're having a good evening, a great tomorrow, and until tomorrow afternoon, I'll see you then. Bye.